Okay, Brian, what did you come up with? How big, how much does this galaxy M33 weigh? All right, so I went through and added up all those stars, and everything added up to 1.4 times 10 to the 10 solar masses, or about 14 time, billion times more than our sun weighs. So that's pretty heavy. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, well, that's not too far different from what I got. I looked at how fast the things on the outskirts of the galaxy were rotating, balanced centrifugal force against gravity, and got you know, about twice what you got, about 3.2 by 10 to the 10. Well, even more masses. than twice. Now, there's a lot of uncertainties here, but I have to admit that's kind of disturbingly larger than the number I got, but maybe it's the same. Well, maybe that was okay for, for a while, but of course that's just the mass near the galaxy. What we can do is measure it much further out. Uh, what I was able to do was, instead of just looking at the galaxy itself, look at the gas around it, which you can see in the radio telescopes, which allowed me to measure the rotation speed not here at the edge of the stars, but way out there. And when I did that, I got a much higher mass. Wow, so that's almost nine times more mass than I measured in stars. And out where you measured it, there weren't any stars, so I know there weren't stars out there, and that gas is just fluff, so there's almost no mass in the gas. So it seems we're missing a lot of stuff. Yeah, it looks like um, in the central region there's not too much of a discrepancy. I'm yeah. seeing a value a bit higher than you were, but not drastically. It seems that most of the discrepancies when you go further out. It's almost as if this galaxy is surrounded not only by gas, which doesn't weigh very much, but by something else much heavier, some dark matter in vast amounts out here in the outskirts of the galaxies. Yeah, and one of the amazing things is this dark matter that we seem to have uncovered here uh, isn't just in M33. It seems to be in almost any galaxy that we go out and we try this experiment on. It seems to be everywhere associated with galaxies.